In a world where leadership often feels distant and disconnected, there are moments that reignite hope. Imagine a conversation where values like financial responsibility, personal accountability, and true leadership come to life, embodied by none other than Elon Musk and Donald Trump. These two towering figures are not just talking. They're setting the stage for something profound. Well, uh, I mean, if, so, so, I mean, I mean, I think it would be great to just have a government efficiency commission that takes a look at, uh, at, at these things and, and just ensures that the taxpayer money, the, the taxpayer's hard-earned money is spent in a good way. Um, and and, I, and I'd, I'd be happy to help out on such a commission. I'd love if, it. If it were fun. Well, you, you're the greatest cutter. I mean, I look at what you do. You walk in and you just say, you want to quit? <laughs> they go yeah. on strike. They, I won't mention the name of the company, but they go on strike and you say, that's okay, you're all gone. You're all gone. So every one of you is gone. And you are the greatest. You would be very good. Oh, you would love it. But, you know, if you look at Arjun. Well, I'd be happy yeah, to help by the way, congratulations. Yeah. I just looked at the number of people that are listening to you and I chat. We'll call it a chat. But uh, yeah. congratulations. This is very good. I mean, it's great. It's, and, and you're an interesting character. You know, the uh, new head of a place called Argentina. And he was he's a big, Malay you know, he's, he's great. And yeah. he's a big MAGA fan. You know that he ran on MAGA. And he took it to an extreme, too. He ran on MAGA, and I hear he's doing really a terrific job. It's called Make Argentina Great Again. It worked out perfectly. He came in, he bought a lot of hats, he brought over it. But he's, he's doing a big job. He really cut. And I'm hearing yeah. they're starting to do pretty well. Inflation's getting down. You know, they had like 2,000%. Yeah, exactly. They had inflation like, like not normal inflation. They had the, the real deal. But we're going to yeah. have that pretty soon. We we have I think yeah. we have the worst inflation we've had in a hundred years. They say it's forty eight years. I don't believe it. I think we have the worst. Yeah. They don't include a lot of the items that should be included. You know. Yeah. Elon Musk, with his relentless drive to cut through inefficiency, sees a vision for the government, one where waste is minimized, and every taxpayer dollar is treated with the respect it deserves. The government efficiency committee's proposals now on the table aren't just bureaucratic suggestions. They represent a movement towards a government that truly serves its people. It's not hard to see why someone like Musk, who has turned private enterprises into marvels of efficiency, would want to lend his expertise to this cause. His involvement isn't just symbolic. It's a testament to the belief that private sector success can pave the way for public sector reform. And then there's Donald Trump, whose enthusiastic, I'd love it, isn't just a response. It's a rallying cry. Trump's history of making bold commitments, often dismissed by skeptics, speaks volumes to his followers who see in him a leader willing to take on the hardest challenges. His alignment with Musk on this issue isn't just political posturing. It's a sign of a strategic alliance between two men who understand the gravity of the moment. Their joint effort to address government inefficiency is more than just a partnership. It's a beacon of hope for those who have long felt disillusioned by empty promises. Musk's decision to step out of the sidelines and actively participate in tackling the nation's problems is a powerful statement of personal responsibility. It's a call to action that resonates deeply with a public yearning for real, tangible change. Trump's leadership, too, shines through in this context. By embracing Musk's proposals, and demonstrating a genuine interest in solving these critical issues. He's showing that leadership is about more than just words. It's about responding to the real, pressing needs of the country. This isn't about politics as usual. It's about two influential figures using their clout to make a difference where it matters most. For Americans tired of waste and inefficiency, the Musk-Trump collaboration is more than just a discussion. It's a promise. It's a signal that their concerns are being heard and that steps are being taken to ensure a more accountable and efficient government. This effort can do more than just bolster trust. It can inspire a renewed belief in what's possible when true leaders come together for the common good.